스 공동 주최자인 김계환 한국 해병대 사령관님과 그 담당자 분께 다시 한번 감사의 말씀을 드립니다. 탈생사는 올해 10회째를 맞이하고 있고 As stated, this week marks the 10th Pacific Amphibious Leaders Symposium, and each participant at PAL, they will share best practices and improve our collective ability to adapt and innovate. 재배치 될수 있다고 보시는지 이것도 하나 답변을 해주시면 감사하겠습니다. 이상입니다. Uh, individually, bilaterally, and collectively, uh, to enhance and improve our operational capabilities. Um, I believe makes us all uh, better so that we might more effectively respond uh, to any situation, whether it be a disaster uh, from... 이런 사람에게 먼저 질문을 드립니다. 7년 만에 팔스를 한국에서 개최를 하게 되는데 인테... Our bilateral relationship and activities uh, remain strong. Land, sea, space, and cyberspace operations. So, so as I thought about my introductory remarks for this panel, it actually brought me back a few short troops and available fire support, terrain and weather, and time of missionary strike. Next is E, enemy, in the Indo-PACOM of action. That brings us to the first T, in troops and available fire support. And I'm going to talk about the latter half, the available of the maritime commerce transits alone through the South China Sea. And that equates to more than this will be absolutely critical for us to be able to maintain the competitive advantage and be able to discussions that we'll have over the next three days. Um, I really am reminded that we are stronger together. So uh, thank you for the opportunity. Our landings at the Lipley event, the Australian Army and Navy certainly did. But um, context is important. And in the middle of April this year, to a focused an integrated force. So let me just unpack that for a minute. What's a balanced force? Well, a balanced force is the way we've been structured and equipped. And we operate under the Chatham House rule, under the policy. Once parcel 2024 is complete, the... <laughs> <laughs> 전략적 접근 방법인 해양 전략을 수립하여 국가 목표 달성을 위해서 노력하고 있으며 그러한 해양 전략의 개념은 과거에는 국가 안보 가치 수호에서 이제는 국제사회의 일원으로서 존재가 전의 시발점이 되는 상륙군 지원 부대 작전 그리고 시 베이싱 그리고 어, 해안 양육 군수 지원 그리고 비군사 상륙전과는 다르게 해상에만 전투력 투사로 작전 템포 유지가 상당히 어렵습니다. But, but fundamentally, the point that he makes is that our challenge of distance across this across this theatre uh, and security across the globe, because I think we can assume that our adversaries are doing the same, and they will apply those lessons uh, that are playing out there directly, uh, directly as systems, both to collect intelligence, to undermine A to AD systems, uh, and to attack. Uh, specifically the Black Sea Fleet. Uh, so we can expect, uh, we are focused very heavily on what we can do by being on the ground before the point of conflict to enable theatre entry uh, to undermine. Or increase the impact of and vulnerability uh, to severe weather and natural disaster. Of fisheries. The Indo-Pacific is home to some of the world's most significant fisheries, supporting millions of people's livelihood. Overfishing, illegal fishing, and temas. Aparte de la guerra convencional, la protección de nuestros recursos naturales y el link, el enlace que hay entre esto y la delincuencia organizada transnacional. Exotic plants. La tala indiscriminada de árboles, bosques para sembrar cultivos ilícitos tales como la cocaína. The illicit uh, destruction of our forests for things like growing coca plants. Tiene diferentes escenarios. International cooperation is super important. Y esa cooperación internacional la hemos construido también como escuela de la cooperación interna bajo el concepto de una gobernanza 
we've uh, developed this concept of <laughs> Please enjoy yourself tonight, and uh, we'll look forward to seeing you again in the morning. Semper Fi. Hurrah.